I think maybe that's also because I'm obsessed with Dara. <laughs> <laughs> I guess we perform most of the songs live. So like mm. learning how to dance and sing at the same time was a little difficult for me because I'm like, I don't work out that much. So I had to like figure out my breathing techniques, but literally everyone is so encouraging and we all help each other out. So like, I guess just singing and dancing at the same time, but it seemed like everybody else got it. It's just me that be struggling. <laughs> for me, I always find the music aspect of it very, um, new and sometimes challenging for me. I've never, um, before the show, had never really recorded music or um, had really done much pop music before. So um, whenever we get new music in the show, I always, um, I always take it on as a little bit of a challenge. And we always, um, you know, feel so encouraged and helped by everybody around us. But it's, you know, it's still something very new that I'm getting used to. And um, yeah, it always ends up super fun, but I always get a little nervous when we, when we get new music. <laughs> You know, Big Red and myself are very similar in a lot of ways. I think I definitely knew more about theater uh, than Big Red in the first season. Um, but just like who Big Red is in high school reminds me so much of who I was, the way that he sees the world, um, the way that he'll be there for his friends and um, getting to see his journey in season two uh, just reminds me so much of some of the things that I went through when I was, you know, a little bit younger. I guess I I think I I know I think I'm gonna say Courtney. <laughs> I feel like <laughs> I feel like I I feel like I need a Courtney in my life. That's something that's missing for sure. I feel like we're into a lot of the same things. I feel like we can bond over makeup and fashion, and mm -hmm. um, she just seems like a really cool friend and somebody whose um, personality would mesh well with mine. I think maybe that's also because I'm obsessed with Dara, <laughs> and, and Courtney is very similar to Dara. So <laughs> maybe I just <laughs> maybe I just um, need a Dara all the time. But yeah, I think I think Courtney I would want as a real person. Which I love I you. Have. <laughs> I love you so much, Julia. I love you. <laughs> I really love um, learning the song, but I also love learning the dance as well. I mean, literally, our dance classes are like a comedy class because everybody's messing up and cracking jokes. It's absolutely amazing, and these talented people here absolutely slay everything, even when we're not filming. Oh, Sharpay. I always resonated with Sharpay as a kid growing up watching the movies. She was always my favorite character. So yeah, I would love to play like a sassy, hot pink wearing diva. That, that would be great. <laughs> I always love stick to the status quo. I just mm -hmm. love the the big, um, you know, the big production number moment, and then getting to like spend time in that cafeteria in real life is just such a cool, yeah. cool thing. <laughs> I think I think that she's really discovering who she is. I think that's kind of what all these characters are going through. That's a really big plot point of of season two is kind of um, who these characters are as individuals. We we got to meet them um, as a group last season and see how they kind of all thrived and shined as a collective. And this season, it's really cool to see how everybody um, can branch off and um, be equally as shiny on their own. So I'm really excited um, for people to see that and how we all grow as individuals. Maybe I could do like a young, a young Hercules, like not after he's like big, but like before he's big, you know, uh, in the beginning of the movie, uh, when that, when that's a show, that, that'll be really fun. Something like that would be really cool. It's so weird because I'm like just discovering myself and figuring out what I like, even at like my age. But I guess I would say I really like to sing. Right now I'm writing music and I really love to sing and dance at the same time. Like, you know, give a little Beyonce real quick. <laughs> I think Ricky is a good best friend. I think definitely mm. in the second season, uh, you will see uh, Ricky's you know, ability to be a great friend uh, tested. And we're all high school kids, right? Like everyone's learning. So I think, you know, Ricky has a good heart and Big Red and Ricky are, are great friends. 